It's plain and simple. There should be no immigrants allowed into this country. Only Americans who were born here are valued and should be able to stay. Thank God we are reopening thousands of deportation cases to speed up the, these deportation rates. I mean, who cares, right, if a seven-year-old doesn't have any known family in Mexico but and she was born here, right? But this seven-year-old little girl is making me and my family look bad. These people are taking American jobs and lowering their wages, even though me, myself, personally, would never work at McDonald's. Don't even get me started on the types of violent crimes they bring. They're bringing drugs, they're bringing crime, and they're all rapists, and some, I assume, are good people. They're the reason why people are dying from overdoses, and they're the people that our children are easily buying drugs off because all they care about is how they get money because they can't survive here in the United States. There are just way too many of them. The overcrowding has gone on for way too long. I can't even go to the grocery store anymore without preparing mentally to wait in a line. They are not our friend, believe me, but they're killing us e economically. The U.S. has become basically just a dumping ground for everybody else's own problems. You look at countries like Mexico, where they're killing us on the border, absolutely destroying us on the border, and they're just destroying us in terms of economic development. In the end, immigrants receive government assistance, government assistance at higher rates than Native Americans. The higher costs of all the services provided to immigrants and the lower taxes they pay because they have lower earnings implies that on a year-to-year -year basis, immigration creates a whole of at least 50 billion, a burden that falls on the native population. Therefore, there should be no immigrants allowed into, in the U.S. borders.